Good afternoon, all my brothers and sisters in Christ. I got little Foxy here with me. She'd rather look at her than look at me. Um, I know you all wanted to know about my reptilian family. Well, I'm putting the puzzle pieces together. Um, growing up, we didn't really know what my dad did for a living. Um, after he retired, he said that he um, uh, worked on a project that he named called Project Pegasus. He worked for the AAI Corporation in um, Cockeysville. He had top secret clearance. He told us um, after he retired that he worked on developing the first satellites. I don't believe in any satellites. Really don't think there is any. And uh, it's just like the puzzle pieces start coming together. Um, I was taking care of my dad a couple years ago. And I was paying his bills and I asked him his passcode to his computer. Hippocampus. Didn't know what that meant. I looked it up in uh, Wikipedia. It's like some kind of mythical... Um, dragon, and it's some type of um, part of the reptilian brain. And it also has to do with memory, MK Ultra. So I've been searching and searching to find out how this word that my dad used um, goes together in my, in my puzzle. And... I um, I made a clip about why I thought I was being a targeted individual because uh, my dad um, was was like working for the AAI is a government contractor, a big one, and um, um, I was mentioning that and. I was talking about the direct energy weapons and the pa direct energy weapons that they were putting in my head. And um, some guy said, look up this um, article on post energy projectiles. And I looked it up and that was from um, who invented that. That's like the microwaves direct energy weapons that they use now. Just another name for it, they call them PEP, Pulsed Energy Projections, that they're putting in my head. And I was reading the article, and the Lord just, he just puts me in the direction. Underneath the related articles, it said, like, Pulsed Energy Projection and how it affects the brain. And then it had Hippocampus. Bingo. I have been looking for what this word meant for about eight months. Here, my little girl. He's so cute. He camera shy. And uh, so it's like, okay, direct energy weapons. I, can, I, can, I keep telling my one son that I can't remember anything I learned in school. And then... Um, that article also was mentioning MK Ultra. That's mind control. And what I think happened is that since my, my parents are both RH positive blood and I have RH negative, and there's like no way that I could be their child. What I'm putting together, I'm not really quite 100% sure this is true, but this is what I'm putting together so far. My dad was involved in the project, but AAI Corporation was called Pegasus Project. It didn't have anything to do with the satellites. I think it had to do a bit with uh, direct energy weapons and the pulsed energy projectiles that they've been using on me. And I believe that either um, I was just put in the family and used as a uh, guinea pig for this MK Ultra. Because I can't remember anything I learned in school. 
except like high school, I remember like my sewing classes and stuff I used to do. But anything else, I think that my memory was like wiped clean, which is kind of a good thing because I, I have found out by going down this journey that everything that you've ever been told is a lie anyway. So I'm just putting the puzzle pieces together. And then if you like have watched any of my other, uh, my reptilian family, um, you'll see how all the puzzle pieces are coming together. Uh, allergies of foxy's shedding for some reason so if anybody knows anything about what hippocampus means i know it means reptilian brain i know it's some kind of weird little dragon and i know it has something to do with your memory i think i'm on the right path i really do and you know I know there's like some people that don't believe me what's going on that you don't have to believe me. I'm just telling my story. Uh, I'm writing a book called Raised by Satanists, Saved by Grace. And um, this is all going to be in the story. But for me, it's a lot easier just to talk and tell you about it. Don't have a computer or anything like that right now. I'm going to work on getting one. But... uh Another piece to the puzzle. So I'm just going to report when the Lord um, tells me or gives me another puzzle piece or somebody comes around and gives me another puzzle piece. I'm just going to keep figuring out this mystery. So that's about the story about my dad and the Pegasus Project. You can look it up. It's in the computer. It's in the computer. Had something to do with satellites, but then I learned there is no satellites. So, stay tuned. I'll be back. I have lots of stories. Hope everybody has a great day. God loves you, each and every one of you, and be the reason somebody smiles today.